Hello there, I am Giant Crow with my Pokemon Leaf Green Redo. In the last part, we took on we took on Treasure Beach, I believe, and then we took on Off 2 Island. And now here on 3 Island, we battled some bikers and stuff, because they were causing trouble. And now here on Bridge Bond, I believe, we're trying to find Lustel, because the game manager, the, the father of Lustel, is worried about her. She kind of just wandered off and stuff. So yeah, uh, I'm going to make sure I have a Pell on, though. Okay, I didn't have a bond. Cool. But now I do. Cool. Let's take on this double battle. I figured who's in my second slot in my party, though. I know I have Firefox up front, though. We'll teach you what our favorite Pokemon is. Okay. That's cool. Here are twins, Joy and Meg. Both have a Clefairy. Okay. So two Clefairies. So Triple Cuff won't be affected by Q Charm, but Firefox might. But then again, it's only physical attacks, I'm pretty sure. So it's just, just fun to on the right one. And a strength on the left one. I don't know if strength of the one it KO'd though. Let's see here. Nope, almost though. Flamethrower should want to KO this fuck of it, but you never know. Both of them are level 37 female. Oh cool, it didn't faint it, but like with the burn will take care of it. Okay, Moonlight. Just use Moonlight to heal half of its max HP. Okay. And then the other Clefairy is going to use Cosmic Power. To raise up its defense, but then the burn should take it out. And special defense too. There we go, nice. Let's go for the quick attack and the strength then. Strength should, yeah. Dang it, cute charm. Okay. Let's go for the strength and hopefully this thing will take it out. Yeah, there we go, nice. Feel free to join Meg. Oh, Meg. <laughs> Thanks for the dollars and 88 cents. Here's a Max Appel. Nice. Very worth picking up. Okay, I still have Firefox up front. I'm pretty sure this, uh, I think this Aroma Lady has a, um, Bulbasaur and Ivers or something. Where are you off to in such a hurry? I'm trying to find Hostel. She's been missing, you know? But let's take on this Uma girl. Or Uma lady. Violet. Okay, she has a Bulbasaur. I think she might have two, a Bulbasaur and two, Ven two Ivysaurs. I don't think she has a Venusaur, to be honest. Which is a bummer. Because it'd be cool if she had a Bulbasaur and an Ivysaur and a Venusaur. But I think she just has a Bulbasaur and two Ivysaurs. So there goes the Bulbasaur. goes down one hit. Nice. That Bulbasaur should, should technically be a Venusaur right now, but that's okay. It's whatever. And this Ivysaur should also be a Venusaur. There we go. There we go. Now Firefox is level 45. Cool. Try to learn Fire Spin. I don't want to learn Fire Spin, honestly. No, I'll skip out on that. On the Ivysaur. Let's go to um, Airbender then. So that's why she has a Bulbasaur and two Ivysaurs. Let's go for the Aerial Ace, I guess. There we go, Critical Hit, awesome. I'll take it. There we go, we have been Uma Lady Violet. Aroma Lady Violet. You're raising some wonderful Pokemon, thank you. Thanks for $10.08 as well. Let's go switch, uh... Firefox with the airbender, I guess. And then switch to Firefox and Giant Green. Let's take on this water type trainer. Yo, yay, Pokemon. I should have switched to Giant Green, though, but I think that uh, airbender can take down all these water type Pokemon, I guess. Let's go for the wing attack. I go on a kill, nice. Let's switch actually over to Giant Green. Just because he has a type advantage then. Star you. Let's go for the Razor Leaf. It's level 34. And it goes down one hit, cool. Let's 
Krabby, okay. Let's go for another Razor Leaf. There we go. I like its cry, it's like, dut, 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 dut. Another Krabby, okay, cool. And yet, we're gonna use another. Yeah, it's this. It's cry is dut, 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 dut. And now we're gonna use another Razor Leaf on this Krabby. Hopefully, it'll find anyone hit. It does. Cool. Giant Green is almost level 45, but I don't think it will- Oh, he'll, he'll, he'll reach level 45. Cool. We defeated two Reluxes. What happened now? What happens now? Well, you don't go- you don't go back to the Pokemon Center like most people- uh, like you should, but that's okay. Thanks for the dollar and 36 cents. So let's keep, um... Yeah, let's keep our Bender up to the front. Okay, yes. There's a trainer actually right here. I think she has a king lawyer. If I, if I do remember correctly. Oh no, don't come here. Please stay away from me. Okay. Let's battle though. Let's have a quick Pokemon battle. This is Swimmer Tisha. She has a king lawyer. Cool, I was right. Let's go for the return on this king lawyer. That's level 38 female. Okay, let's go for the return, yeah. Almost want to kill it. Let's go for the wing attack. There we go, nice. Pretty fits with Morticia. Okay, you've won now, will you please go away? Sure, why not? I'll do that right now. Thanks for dollar and 52 cents. <laughs> Let's take on this tuber, I guess. Uh, my mom said I can't swim without my foot wing. Okay. But it's a tube. It can also be called the foot wing, I guess. Maybe that's what the kids are calling it these days. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, let's go for the wing attack on this Poliwag. Let's hope it won't kill us. That'd be nice. That'd be real nice. And then the Poliwag. Okay, cool. Oh, I might didn't want to kill it. Let's gotta go for the water gun. Let's go for another wing attack then. It's probably what was level 35 in the mail, but it goes down. Now, Airbender is level 45, nice. Poliwag, okay. Let's switch to uh, Trebcliff. Let's go for the Thunderbolt on this thing. It's gonna be super effective. Oh wow, I think that's what she said. Thanks for dollar and thirty six cents. I'm gonna put um trouble cover with the front. Let's take on this trainer right here. It's salty the salty tang of the sea, it tickles my heart. Yeah, I guess you could say that. <laughs> Here's another Romo lady. Romo lady Nikki, she says that bell spread, okay. Let's go for the strike attack on this thing. It's level 37 female. And it goes down one hit, cool. Weeping ball, cool. Stun support, jeez. Just strength again, I guess. And it faints it nice. Pretty if you're a Nikki. Um, sniff, sniff, something smells unpleasant. Oh man, I'm sorry for that. Thanks for the $10.36. Let's go for the. Let's see your um, trouble cough up with the paralysis heal. Yeah, there we go. Cool. Okay, here's Barry Forest. And let's put a repel on if we don't already have a repel on. Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, still lingers. Okay, cool. 
Yeah, if you have a cut, you can actually take some shortcuts to avoid the tall grass. But since I don't have a cut, I'm gonna have to just, uh, go the long way, I guess. Which I don't mind, really. Oh, here's a berry. It's a Chester berry that cures sleep, uh, that heals sleep, I guess, if your Pokemon falls asleep. But you already have the Pokemon at this point, so, like, how is this not a berry? How is this not a berry? It's a dark spot on the ground. It's psyched, it's psyching us out here. I mean, you'd think that there'd be a berry there. But, like, I keep on pressing AA against it, and it's nothing. And that berry, there should there better be a berry over there where you see that dark spot in the off part of the screen. Jeez. Let's put another pearl on. Is this a berry? Yes, okay, it's a rust berry. That's, um, rust berry. It takes, it heals burn, I guess. I know it heals burn, actually. Here's a max ether. And here should be another berry. But of course, it's called the berry force. So you'd think there'd be a lot of berries in here, but like, this one's not, this is a fake too. There's no berry there. Is there a berry here? Nope, of course. Wait, is there a berry here? Maybe I'm just not, I thought those were dark spots, but apparently they don't count or something. Here's a Nadna berry. What does that do actually? Let's look it up. Berry pouch. Um, Nadna berries, where are they? Um, it, it can be grounded in powder as an ingredient for medicine. Okay. We have two of those apparently. Here's another spot. It's a petri berry, he has poison. Oh, there. That's all stuff right there. Now there's a Pokemon and a Hypno that's gonna attack her, so like, we wanna try to catch that for Pokedex. Almost we've already have it. I don't think we have a Hypno added to my Pokedex yet. So, uh. Let's switch to Mimean, I guess, because I'm going to use, like, side beams, so it's not very effective, so we don't knock it out. But yeah, let's talk to Lostel. Lostel says, Whimper, Sniff, oh, please help. A scary Pokemon appeared there a little while ago. It kept, on, it kept, scare, it kept scaring, uh, scarring, I guess. Um, it made Lostel scared. Okay. It's, uh, I'm too scared to move, but I want to go home. She's all shocked. Oh, no, here it comes again. No, go away. It's scaring me. Uh, or, yeah, I think it's scaring, not scarring, my bad. Wow, I want my daddy. Oh, have I, have I heard that cry before? It's a hypno, of course. So this one's level 30. Let's go for the, um, Psybeam, I guess. There we go, cool. Let's get his headbutt on us. Let's go for another Psybeam. Poison gas. Oh man. You hypno, why do you have to do that to my poor Mimian? You poisoned Mimian, how could you? Okay, cool. Let's just use another side beam. One more side beam should put it in the reds, I think, but it could be yellows, yes still. Okay. That's okay. We won't look it down anymore. Again, we haven't caught this because it's not the little Pokeball next to it, so it's a little under its name. So uh yeah. Let's cut the one ultra ball at this thing. There we go. One, two, three. And we caught it, yay. Hypno was caught. Hypno today was out of the Pokedex, cool. Hypno's number 97 in the Pokedex. It's a name is Hypno, of course. It's Hypnosis Pokemon. It's five foot, uh, three inches tall. It weighs 166.7 pounds. Its footprint looks like a big, just a big footprint overall. It's just a big footprint. Uh, when it looks, locks eyes with an enemy, it will use a mix of PSI moves, what is this, Earthbound? <laughs> Such as Hypnosis and Confusion. Because Earthbound came before Pokemon, right? Because, I thought it did, because it came out in like 1995, and Pokemon came out in like 1997, 1996 or something. I could be completely wrong with that. Yeah, let's give it the to Hypno, okay. Let's, um, let's name him Earthbound. Okay, does a uh, not earthbound fit? Not earth. Earth. Uh, bound. Not earthbound. Not earthbound. That, that works, it's abbreviated kinda. <laughs> not earthbound. Yeah, that's that's a silly name, honestly, but it works, I guess. Oh, thank you. That oh, that was scary. Thank you. Well, I still came to pick some berries. Okay, you can have this. We got them pepper berry. 
I forget what that one does actually. What's um your name? I'm still scared, so can I go with you to my daddy's house? Okay, let's go home. So you rescued Lostel, how could I thank how can I thank you? Uh Lostel's darling Lostel darling, forgive me. Daddy didn't know you were scared and in trouble. It's okay, Daddy, I got to be friends with Steven. And then uh we actually have to exit the house and come back in to give him the meteorite that uh, Bill, Bill and Celio told us to deliver to him. So yeah, oh man, I forgot that man is poisoned. Dang it. Oh, what's that you're saying that you have this for me? Uh, how did you know I love her rocks and gems? You should know, know how to make it. You should know how to make a guy happy. We hand over the meteorite to Austell's daddy. Daddy. Uh, oh, I see. It's this is from Bill. You you have to thank him for me. You know, you've been fantastic. I wanted you to have this on another moonstone. So that's awesome. You should at least have four moonstones by the by this point. So enough to evolve like Jigglypuff and uh, Nervin male, Nervin female, uh, Nervino, Nervin, Nervina, and uh, Kofari. And you should have enough moonstones, I think, by now to evolve all the Pokemon that need moonstone to evolve for your Pokedex. See, so, yeah, that's pretty cool. We got another moonstone, yay! I wonder if the PC store services are still are up now. I could be wrong though. Let's heal up a Pokemon real quick. There we go. Yeah, we well, restored a Pokemon for health. Look okay. at, yeah, the PC, the PC storages are working now. Nice. Let's go um deposit some items real quick. Um, like the Firestone, the Max Ether. And the moonstone. Nice. And I guess we can show off that hypno right now. I don't want to show it off unless like go a Pokemon, but that's okay. This will be an exception, I guess. Feel feel special hypno or not earthbound. Let's go to the summary. It's a calm nature. Men and berry force at level 30. Cool. Its attack is 49, its defense is 55, its special attack is 50, its special defense is 88, and its speed is 53. Uh, its insomnia is its ability, it prevents sleep so it can't fall asleep. That's actually a good ability, actually. <laughs> cool. It has confusion, headbutt, poison, guess, and meditate. Silver 30, cool. Male. Nice. So, let's put my meme back. Um. I guess it's a tri 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 triple cough, I guess. Yeah, there we go. Actually, I want to put up um, a Strymon to the front because we're actually taking on the uh, Viridian City Gym, and that's an Earth type gym. After we um, talked to Bone Celia back at One Island. So, yeah, let's go to One Island again. Here we go. Back on One Island, here we are. Nice. Let's go in here. Talk to Bill. Yeah. Oh, hey, Steven. Uh, what kept you so long? Been out having a good time? Yes, I have. Uh, we got it done. The PCs are up and running. Yep, I know. Because I just deposited three items in my PC. Um, yeah, the job went incredibly quick. Bill is an amazing guy. No, no, that was almost nothing. There was almost nothing left for me to do. Celio, I have to hand it to you. You've learned a lot. Oh, really? He <laughs> he. Uh well there have there you have it I finished with the I'm finished with the job we should head back to Kanto Celia I'll be seeing you again Stephen I'm really sorry that we sent you off alone today I promise I'll show you around these islands sometime I don't think he ever does you just explore them by yourself really so he kind of broke that promise I guess you could say hey wasn't that a long cruise my my buddy Celio seemed to enjoy your company I'm sure he'd visit he'd welcome you if you wanted were to visit him again if you have a tripod you can always take the ferry there from from where in port all, all right thanks for your company where does bill go do you think it, I don't think I have any water type Pokemon to surf on or else I could be completely wrong you might so with that we'll fly back to Viridian City which is right here nice And with that, we're going to take on the gym in the next part, our 8th and final gym, you know, so we got 8th gym batch my pro off right there, so good timing. So yeah, let's go around here. If you talk to this guy, he said the gym was locked or never, or the gym leader hasn't returned yet or something at the beginning of the game. He'll say now the Viridian gym leader, the Viridian gym is the way to return, returned. Cool. So yes, that's been my Pokemon Leaf Green video arc third part, and the next part we'll take on the Viridian City Pokemon gym, it's an Earth-type gym.
This is gonna be a lot of fun. I I do have um Stymen up front, right? Yes, I do, because Stymen's a water type Pokemon. It'll be super effective against all these ground type Pokemon that are coming out of us. So yeah, this is Vinjanko again. I would like to wish you goodbye, and hope to see you guys. Let's put my Pokemon Leaf Green redo walkthrough guide.